What's going on guys? It's me, Ryan again, and today we're gonna go over the five salsa basics. We're gonna start with something called a stationary basic step or basic in place. And really what it is, is just marching in place. We're gonna start with our left leg and we're gonna do three steps, break three steps. So how does that look? We're gonna go one, two, three, five, six, seven. One more time. Left leg free, we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So for the four and eight count, we're not gonna do anything, we're gonna take a breather. We're gonna do that one more time. We're gonna go left leg, right leg, left leg, right leg, left leg, right leg. I'm gonna turn around for you guys, just so you guys can have a better idea as to what we're doing. Again, we're having one, two, three, five, six, seven. So that was the stationary salsa basic. And we usually use that kind of just to feel out the music or as a transitional step. This is just to get a great idea as to the tempo of the music and what we're gonna go into. So now the next step that we're doing is the basic salsa step. Now the golden rule that I use here is left leg forward, right leg back. So how do we do this? So we're gonna take the same exact beat values as we did in that stationary salsa basic and we're gonna apply into moving steps. I'm gonna turn around for you guys just so you have a better idea. We're gonna start with our left leg and we're gonna step forward. So we're gonna go forward, replace, together. Now we're gonna take our right leg, we're gonna step back, replace, together. Back, replace, together. I'm gonna do this one more time with the left leg. Here we go. Forward, replace, together. Take it back, back, replace, together. One more time, one, two, three, five, six, seven. We're gonna do four each. So I'm gonna jump back into the stationary salsa basic, combine that regular salsa basic, and create that amalgamation, okay? So we're gonna go in, stationary salsa basic, here we go, starting with the left leg. We're going one, two, three, that's one, five, six, seven, that's two, one, two, three, that's three, five, six, seven, that's four. If done right, your left leg should be free and we're gonna step forward. One, two, three, that's one, five, six, seven, that's two, one, two, three, that's three, five, six, seven, that's four. If done right, left leg should be free, okay? Combine them all together, I'm just gonna do the counts. Here we go. Left leg, one, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. Go one, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. All right, going into our third step, which is either called the second position break or the side break. Uh, it comes in with different names. So we're, today we're just gonna call it the side basic, okay? The side basic is gonna have the same exact beat value. The concept is almost the same. The only difference is we're stepping onto the side on both legs. So starting with our left leg, we're gonna open up to the left. We're gonna go one, two, three, open to the right, five, six, seven. As you can see, I'm taking a step, replace, together, step, replace, together. So one more time. One, two, three, five, six, seven, one, two, three, five, six, seven. I'm gonna turn around just so you guys can follow me a little bit easier. We have our left leg free. We're gonna to step to the left to the side. We're gonna go step, replace, together to the right. Step, replace, together to the left. Step, replace, together to the right. Step, replace, together. Now, bonus tip. It's super, super important for you guys not to take huge steps. The ideal step would be about the width of your shoulders. The reason why is because it's easier to maneuver when you have small steps. So you don't have to worry about being late to music. Now, if I were to take huge steps, be it forward or side, back, doesn't matter. It takes way longer for me to do that weight transfer. However, if the legs are just underneath my body, it's almost like you're doing everything in place. So you have a lot more maneuverability and you can just do it to music. Okay, we are up to our fourth step, and this is the back break, also known as the fifth position break. 
We're gonna call it the back break. It is very, very simple. It is a little bit confusing in the sense that we're going back on both legs. But what does that look like? So I'm gonna turn around. After doing that side basic, we finished over here, boom. Left leg should be free. All we're gonna do is step back, replace together. So it's gonna be one, two, three, five, six, seven. As you can see, both legs are working back. One, two, three, five, six, seven. I'm gonna do that four times, okay? So one more time, left leg shooting back. Here we go. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One more time, here we go. And one, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. Excellent. What I'd like to do is I'd like to take all those four steps, combine them together, and create that nice amalgamation. Let's do it. Here we go. Starting with the stationary basic step, left leg, and one, two, three, five, six, seven, one, two, three, five, six, seven. Going into the basic, left foot forward, one, two, three, right foot back, five, six, seven, one more time, one, two, three, last one, five, six, seven. We're gonna open up to our side basic, left leg, one, two, three, right leg, five, six, seven, one more, one, two, three, last one, five, six, seven. Heading into our back break with our left leg back, go back, replace together, back, replace together, back, replace together, last one, back, replace together, left leg should be free. Okay, here comes the last and Honestly, the most fun for me step. It's the crossover break, okay? Now, the crossover break, some people call, call it the cumbia step, forward cumbia step. We're gonna call it the crossover. Um, is honestly kind of just like the back break, except we're gonna go a little bit diagonal when we're stepping across. So, what does that look like? Our left leg is gonna be free. I take our left leg, we're gonna cross over to the right together, and we're gonna do the exact same thing over to the left. Right leg crosses the left, and we're here. So we're kinda of doing a little bit of the opposites here. So when I open up to the right, the left leg's crossing over. When I open up to the left, the right leg's gonna cross over, okay? So coming back from that back break, our last one, five, six, seven, left leg should be free. We're going into that diagonal with the left leg. We're literally crossing the left leg over the right. We're gonna go. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. Again, make sure that you guys keep it super compact. It's the best way to get that maneuverability and easy to stay coordinated. We're gonna do that one more time, just the crossover break. Starting with the left leg, we're gonna cross over the right and open up to the diagonal. We're gonna go one, two, three, right leg crossing over the left, five, six, seven, left leg crossing over the right, one, two, three, right leg crossing over the left, five, six, seven. Great. What I wanna do now is take all those five steps, combine them together, and then we're gonna try it to music. Here we go, starting with the stationary salsa basic step. Starting with the left leg in place, one, two, three. Five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. Salsa basic. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six. Side basic. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. Back break. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three. Five, six, seven, cross over. One, two, three. Five, six, seven. One, two, three. Five, six, seven. If you guys like this video, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. I want to get more videos out to you guys ASAP, so don't miss out. See you next time.